At BioAster, we developed a nanoparticle platform called NanoCage. It's based on encapsulin engineered nanocompartments from Thermotoga Maritima. We have customized these nanocages to enable simultaneous surface display and protein cargo loading. 60 copies of identical subunits of encapsulin auto assemble to form a nicosahedral capsid like particle of 24 nanometers of diameter. In bacteria, encapsulin-mediated nanocompartments have been discovered recently. They are able to package functional enzymes via a short targeting sequence that leads the enzyme to bind to the interior surface of encapsulin. For our platform, we use this specific cargo loading sequence to package non-native cargo proteins. Engineering of encapsulin makes it possible to display peptides on the surface and efficiently load cargo proteins. Nanocage generation combines three steps. Bicystronic genetic constructs are designed encoding encapsulin monomers fused to the epitope of interest, while the cargo protein is fused to the loading sequence. This design allows nanoparticle generation with exposed epitope surface presentation and packaged cargo proteins. Today, we are also working on conjugation approaches to enable surface display of entire antigen. To do this, a conjugation peptide is fused to encapsulin and the antigen is expressed separately in fusion with a second conjugation sequence. These conjugation sequences interact by generating a stable peptide bound between the antigen and the nanocarrier. This design allows the generation of nanocages with antigen surface presentation and packaged cargo proteins. Nanocage production is performed in E. coli. Purification of nanocages is done using a stepwise purification protocol described by my group earlier. The protocol allows co purification of nanocages and loaded cargo proteins with high degree of purity. Purified nanocages are biochemically characterized using size exclusion chromatography, dynamic light scattering, and transmission electron microscopy. Our nanocages allow peptides or entire antigens to be displayed at the surface and in contrast to virus-like nanocarriers, they are able to actively encapsulate non-native proteins. Interestingly, the surface engineering enhances cargo loading capacity that increases the number of proteins packaged from 1 to 30 molecules with a mean molecular weight of 25 kilodalton. As it's already known, from other nanoparticle types, the particulate presentation, the size of the carrier and the dense repetitive subunit organization triggers and stimulates the immune response. Indeed, our engineered nanocages elicit antibody responses against both the surface displayed epitope and the cargo load. Finally, the production process in E. coli is reproducible, low-cost and GMP compatible. If cargo-loaded proteins require post-translational modifications, nanocages in cargo load can also be co-produced in mammalian cells. Our nanocages are robust and versatile and we have identified three major biomedical applications. First, nanocages can be used for rational vaccine design and antigen delivery. Second, the ease of cargo loading can be addressed to develop precision antimicrobial therapeutics. And finally, nanocages can be used for targeted enzyme delivery. Therefore, we are interested in setting up collaborative projects and proof of concept using our nanocage technology for applications in the field of microbiology and infectious diseases. <laughs>